there was no way that we could just say, so long, keep warm and well fed. That first time walking into the village, the poverty was real. Just finding these people who had been known as the forgotten village, I just couldn't wrap my head around in the century that we're in that people don't have good, clean drinking water. Getting on the bus to leave, we were our, our wheels were already turning, you know, what can we do? We know that education is a way out of poverty, and so we want to equip them with some technology so that they can learn more and more. And this year we are starting to work on some um, technology in the school there in Playa de Oro, and so that's where we're going to start with the young people there. So part of my um, job here at St. Michael is um, putting on events. What, what do we want here at St. Michael? Of course, we want to have we want to have some fun and some fellowship with each other. So we've all heard the, the saying that it takes a village to raise a child, but in our case, I think it takes a church to raise a village. It's a little bit of work for the team, but I have a great team. And it helped us that first year with the water project, we did two of them. Because of your generosity, we have been able to um, finish the water plant. And then now also um, we purchased Rachel, which is a device that will go into the school. And I just thank all of our people that have been generous to our projects, generous to our food donations, our events, for all your support. We thank you.